Hello again, and today we are uh, on lesson 12.2. You will need your uh, activity page 12.3 for this. And if you will go find it and then pause the video and then come back when you are ready to begin the lesson. Okay, I'm glad you're back. Today, students will revise their personal narrative drafts to incorporate good and varied details. So we're going to change around our personal narrative drafts to add some varied details. So what you're going to do is look at activity page 12.3 and read along with me. Now that you've practiced identifying good and varied details, use this skill to improve your own personal narrative writing. Follow these steps to add to or improve your details. Uh, number one, begin by rereading your narrative. So get your narrative out, the different sections, and reread it. Underline each event from your personal planner in a different color. And read your draft a second time. This time, use the same colors to circle the de details describing each event. If you want to do that, that's fine. But what I want you to really look at are the verbs and uh, the action that is going on in these events, in your narrative. Now, what I want you to do is to look at these different things. Uh, it, look at the different events on 8.4. Event one, the thing, the first thing that happened in your story, in your narrative, what was that first thing? Was it something, did it look like something? Did you see something, what something looks like? Did you see what something feels like? Was something said in there? Was something, uh, did you hear something? Did you smell or taste something? Was there a physical action? or was there a quote? Now, you want to change, and in the last lesson, we did some of this too, but we're trying to fine tune, we're trying to pick out all of those verbs like, I went, I went, I went. Instead of saying, I went, maybe do uh, some different words. We traveled instead of, I went, I traveled, I, um, I biked. If you were, if your story is about a bicycling event, I biked, I rode in the car too. So change it around a little bit. And that's what we're talking about today. In this first event, the first thing that you did, did you do one of these things? Was something said? Well, instead of using said all the time, exclaimed, yelled, shouted, whispered, answered. These are all different things. That's what we're trying to do in today's lesson. So I want you to go back and brainstorm over these different events from 8.4. These events are in 8.4. These are 8.4 events. Go back and look at them and see if any of these details can be changed in that event. And that's the whole lesson for today. Are there any details that need to be changed in that event? Now, after fall break, you will be asked to uh, finish writing your personal narrative and to complete the finished product that next week after fall break. So do your details, do your editing and your revising now. That's the lesson for today.